Well, more than one tournament, but but Chu still was like an undeniable presence, like getting second place at this crazy amount of tournament. Yeah, yeah. Basically eclipsed by Ken, but still such a huge player. FD, really? Yeah. Why? <laughs> that, is, that is... Well... He's not approaching you. I guess, you. well, Chu knows what he's doing. Let's yeah. see. <laughs> You this is like the stage we saw yesterday when uh, Armada four-stock Jules. He did? Yeah, so uh, Holland had the lead against Sweden oh, by yeah, four yeah, stocks. Yeah. Oh. Armada comes in looking like the angriest man of all time. <laughs> He's like, what have you done to my boys? I do not ap approve of this. And now I'm going to four-stock this Ice Climbers. Poor Jules. Yeah. This is an Ice Climbers of a diff oh, different caliber. But still, like, this is extremely rough. Yeah. Something Armada does really well in this matchup is that he separates them, goes for Nana, but sort of fakes it and uh, punishes Popo for trying to get in. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. He knows how to multitask between the two. Yeah, exactly. Well. Some people tunnel vision on Nana really hard. Armada doesn't do that. For Ice Climbers, the key in this matchup is to avoid forward air. If you can avoid forward air, you're good. But it's not an easy task because Peach is uh, she's such a threatening character. And if you get too scared of the forder, if you go back too much, uh, you're gonna get cornered, and at some point the forder just becomes unavoidable. Yeah. The oh, that's oh, it. That's there the wobble. <laughs> nice, nice conversion by Chu. This Cla is what he needed. Yeah, classic jab grab. Something Chu utilizes a lot. This matchup is often com considered impossible for ice climbers, but if there's anything ice climbers can do, is avoid the oh. Nice. It's avoid the forder by Peach. And then try and get uh, the grab on a whiff punish. Yeah. But again, easier said than done because <laughs> when Peach does float cancel aerials, she has no lag. Yep. So she is very, very difficult to, to grab. Not to mention, Ice Climbers are characters that control space horizontally and vertically very well, but not so much diagonally. They don't have that much that to deal with the diagonal space, yeah. which and Peach completely dominates here. Peach can just float in that perfect, you know, uh, height where Ice Climbers can't really do anything. Exactly. Ooh, okay, big combo here. Ooh, he didn't go out. This is the hardest uh, player in the world to face for any Ice Climbers. This is like, yeah. this is like some final boss in the video game that you're not supposed to beat. Especially not. Oh, nice. Well, on, on Wow, Chu is in the lead. <laughs> the crowd, uh, the crowd uh, in. Uh, <laughs> so there's a thing about Europe, European tournaments, and Armada. Armada has won so much in Europe, has won so many times that at some point he kind of became a bit of a, an accidental villain in a way. Yeah. Where not the villain in the sense of. Uh, no, not yeah. in the villain in the sense that people are disliking. People yeah. love him here, but the thing is. People want to see change. People want to see someone else uh, at the top. Yeah. People don't mind uh, the upsets here. Upsets are hype and uh, they're appreciated here in Europe. Oh, wow. okay, that's yeah. Nana. And a lot of people are huge fans of the Ameri the North American players that came here. Like, a like I think the North American players have felt very welcome here in Europe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's uh, one of the things. Like yesterday, I was pr talking to Nun, and we were talking a bunch about uh, American players, and he was really surprised, like uh, about, uh, how much we know about the Americans and how much yeah. we like them. Uh, people were saying that like, if Ar if Armada's playing uh, Mango, I'm cheering for Mango, and he was very surprised about that. Yeah. Okay, so Armada is up now. <laughs> From nowhere, he just. Chu keeping it pretty good. Oh, oh, this is the grab. Does he get the... Oh! oh! <laughs> Chu evens it out. Chu Takes that. it to the last stock. Who expected that? That's crazy. crazy now he only needs one grab and he might take a game of Armada, which is kind of unheard of at this point. I will never question Chu that's uh, stage picks again. This is working out very good for him, but this oh, could this be is, Nana. Oh, oh protects Nana so oh. well. Gets the fourth smash. Beautiful. Oh, okay. Tries to catch him with a down tilt, doesn't doesn't hit Peach there. Chew that is in the Chew that lead. Extremely patient. Look at look at him just standing there. <laughs> oh, okay. Like come at me, Armada. Oh, oh this might be it! Oh, oh okay, he doesn't no, get the proper no, no. setup. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Will, oh! will he take it? Oh my goodness, that, he misses it! No, that was that's his chance. Be Nana. That's that was his be Nana. chance. Wow, okay, that's But this is not impossible. A no. stray hit, a stray up smash can still 
crowd roaring Sopo <laughs> right now. He did. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. Up smash. Oh, he gets That's the up smash. That's it. Chu That's takes game the game. One. Wow. Of Armada <laughs> here at Air 3. Oh my goodness. Wow, Chu that really just took a game of Armada with Ice Climbers. Are you serious, Chu? That's crazy. And look, he's not even reacting. Oh, he, he knows he has work to do. This is the set has. is far from over. And if there's anyone who can just turn it up and take it 3 1, it's Armada. And Chu <laughs> knows that. So he has to work Whoa. his butt off right now. The venue just went but crazy the, there. The first important step was taken here. He took two stocks of Armada with Sopo. That's unbelievable. His Sopo is just amazing. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Wow. Okay, so let's see what he can do here in Dreamland. Okay, Armada gets rid of Nana already. Two off stage. Has Wobbles taken games of Armada? Has Wobble? I don't think he has. I don't think so either. Oh, I don't okay. think anyone has taken a game of Armada. <laughs> uh, maybe Fly? I'm not sure about Fly, but... but oh, I miss Fly. I, oh, I, tries to catch the turnip. I really want to get a tweet from uh, Tafukins if he's watching, if he can tell us if any Ice Climbers... Okay. Ah, okay, thank you. We're gonna get thank that. Thank you, Leva. Leva is looking up for the for the data. But uh, yeah, Armada took this first stock pretty convincingly. But uh, yeah, Ice Hammers, it's not, it's not impossible for them to take it back, but they have to get those grabs, and those grabs are very tough to get. Or they have to get stray hits, and those are also difficult to get. Now, Chew. Armada picked this, picked this stage. He has the lead. He can play patiently on the platforms. Chu is play, playing this so passively, and it's working out. Yeah. He's not approaching. He's just standing still in one spot waiting for Armada. 3-0. Okay. Oh, yeah. So apparently, Armada has never, ever lost a game to Ice Climber. So this is the first time he's History lost. History being made here at Air. Yeah. Chu being the first Ice Climbers ever to take a game of Armada. Hashtag Leva stats. <laughs> <laughs> Leva stats are better than Tafa stats, I think. Oh, shots. <laughs> shots. Statements were made. Oh. Yeah, so Chudat, you, you talked about his passivity. That's, that's something he's actually known for. Mm -hmm. He's known for not... Like, if he knows he doesn't have to take any major risk, he won't do that. And he's done that in many games, uh, throughout many games. This is why a lot of people get frustrated by Chu and his playstyle. He's even known to play like that in other games, other Smash games. Yeah, he, w he was known for that in Brawl, and he was also known for that in Project M. Yeah. So, it's, uh, it's definitely, uh, he, he's, definitely most <laughs> of, he's definitely a risk-averse player most of the time. Who does, uh, who did he play in Brawl? I'm just curious. Uh, Kirby. He oh, played Kirby too. in okay. both Brawl and Project Down. Cool. Okay, so uh, this game's looking a bit more in Armada's favor, but not impossible. He did get a wobble of our, uh, Armada last game. Was it one? Yeah, I think he just got one. No. Yeah. Did he even get one? A yeah, wobble? He, oh, yeah, he definitely got, yeah, some, he got one. Okay. a wobble. Okay, that's Nana. This yeah. is very hard now. This is pretty rough for him. Could get the down throw up smash like he got last game. Maybe he's gonna go for it here. No, okay. No. Armada D has a way. I wonder. Okay, spikes into the stage. Oh, nice. <laughs> and just challenges nice. Armada. He's yeah. like, oh, you're gonna stand there? I'm just gonna down smash you. Uh, he's taking so many stocks as Popo. It's crazy. Yeah, Sopo. Sopo too strong right now. Yeah. Chu's Sopo is like famous for uh, crazy comebacks and uh, just, you know, he makes Sopo look good. I feel like sometimes Sopo uh, feels uh, less stressful. Yep. So, um, Sopo can feel less stressful than having Nana because with Nana you're always thinking about, oh, should I protect her? Should I go here? Should I go there? What these things should I use? Uh -huh. Etc. But when you're Sopo, you only have one character. You only have. Yeah. You don't, and you don't have that much to lose. The only thing, the only goal in your mind is to do as much damage as you can with Sopo. So yeah, a lot exactly. of Ice Climbers actually enjoy playing as Sopo. Chudak goes back to his tactic of just standing. Oh, I've seen so many Mr. Oh, Shadows. Oh, he this almost tournament. shielded that. That was dangerous. Yeah. Oh wow! Big punish here from Armada. <coughs> <laughs> I love how he stands there. He's yeah, it looks, looks funny. 
The ice climbers are just contemplating life, you yeah. know, they're just standing there like... Sure doesn't look like high level. Oh, oh yeah, the air dodge is not going to do it. Dominant second game from Armada, as expected. Where do you go from here if you chew that? Um, mm. what's I, I, I would expect Stadium at this point, because it's going to get a stage that's similar to... Uh, Final Destination. To Final Destination. Yeah, yeah. that's what I thought. Yeah, exactly. you got it. So, uh, he's going to get a stage that's similar. Armada does have the platform, so he can play a similar game like he did on Dreamland. But it's he's not going to have as much survivability. Mm -hmm. And I would believe the transformation is just uh, probably favor Peach here. Yeah. Though Chu does have more space to, uh, to nice. deal with uh, Ar uh, Peach's air game. Good follow-ups here, keeping her in the air. Okay, so Chu in an early lead here, at least in percent, as Armada is playing his game. Oh, wow. <laughs> Armada just, uh, yeah, this is not a comfortable position for Chu. He's cornered, Ooh. and he might lose Nana yeah. on this, and he does. He's going to have to put in work with this Sopo again. And that's that's the scary thing, is that you, you naturally have to wave dash back or move backwards to avoid uh, Peach's offense, and at some point you, you're just cornered. Armada is uh, pulling so many turnips right now. Yeah. He's like, if you want to stay there, you know what? I'll just pull turnips and poke at you. He'll take any advantage he can in the neutral yeah. against Sopo. Okay, he goes down. <laughs> he rolls to avoid them. That's interesting, actually. I never thought of that as a way to avoid Yeah, it's them. working. <laughs> the crowd chanting A hey, every time. You <laughs> now Armada goes down. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's not Armada a place you want to be. Armada wins the scramble, and that will be the kill. Yeah. Chu's face has been the same since this hit started. It's like he hasn't yeah, moved Chu, a muscle. Yeah, very solid mental, mental state. Yeah. Usually. That's Does why he pulls off crazy comebacks. Never gets phased. Yeah. He's like he's down right now, but he's still playing his game. He doesn't care. He's yeah. not getting like flustered. Oh, stitch oh, face. Oh, stitch face. This is dangerous. Careful. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Oh, oh that nice was so to avoid. Oh, and he gets the grab gets into the wobble! wobble. <laughs> the clutch! The clutch! Shoot! That was so smart. The, the side B to avoid wow, the stitch phase. Yeah. That was beautiful. That was so good. He jumped and the side B immediately teleported Nana to Hobo's location. Has to not get hit by the stitch phase. But Nana immediately dies. That was Unfortunate a short stay. for, for Chuda right oh, now. Oh, we got chain grabs. Keeping our mod up with the uppers. Here. Yeah, wow. We got a, a good 30% on that. Okay. Ooh, no jump. I thought he had to jump, but it got caught by that nair. So we're back to the same situation, but both players have one stock less now. Ooh. Yeah, this He's is not so a good position. He, he yeah. keeps retreating every time. And he, needs to, yeah. he needs to fight for his space. When he retreats enough, Armada starts going in because he's cornered, and that's favor favorable for Armada. Okay. The more he lets Armada pu uh, pull these uh, turnips, the bigger the chance for something crazy. Yeah. And Armada, you and, know... Uh, we can't... And Chudad is not always going to be lucky with the... With the stitch face like he was there. Yeah. He exactly. did gamble on that side B, but it paid off. It's scary. Such a scary, like. This is some high level uh, melee here. Armada playing the lottery, but didn't get the three sevens. Yeah. <laughs> on the slot machines. Okay. Armada floating in above Chu. Chu trying to. Get him with, oh, that's oh, not... Oh, and Nana already dies. No up B, that was... Oh, air know. dodge doesn't pay off. Another air dodge. Now he's forced to side B. There's only one option left. Now he's going to die. Yep. Yeah. Sopo can... <laughs> it's actually pretty hard to kill combo uh, Sopo off those squalls, but he can't really do anything. He's just going to be a rinse and repeat a lot of times. You can just hit him over and over again. Mm -hmm. Until he's at high enough percent, just like now. Okay, so he's gonna have to put in a lot of work right now. Get a wobble or two. I wonder. Uh, Shuda trying to reach out to Armada, but just doesn't seem to be able to get anything clean. But he got him off stage, so this might be a chance. Goes for the Hail Mary for there. 
Damn, is he good at... Uh... Oh, that's... Oh, nice. He saves Nana, but this might not be enough. Is he going to be able to... No, he's too far. Yeah, okay, this so is going to be rough. <laughs> this is a three-stock uh, Sopo yeah. comeback. And at this point, uh, if, if Wobbles was playing, he would already be SDing <laughs> and going <laughs> on to the next match. That's not how True rolls, but at this point, I don't know how he can make this comeback. If you put impossible into a melee sequence this is pro probably it <laughs> yeah the word impossible but yeah he takes that stock i wonder if he's gonna try another stage after this possibly like uh, fountain it's funny because i'm like sure <laughs> when uh Chu struck to final destination or mata was like what what the hell is this guy thinking and then he lost. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, okay, that's it. So we're and gonna that is go the in third here. game for Armada. He's up two one. It's uh, it's definitely not easy for uh, for Chiro right now, but uh, he has to keep on. Definitely, he's not the type of player to give up, but still, he's up against the, some of the hardest odds. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Found uh, found of dreams. As they get a neutral start going. You really have to thread the needle in this matchup. This is this is similar to Ow, so that's this, gonna this be is, this, this to me this feels like this feels like a matchup you would see in some kind of old school fighting game. <laughs> like some kind of crazy 9-1-8-2 matchup where you need one little you you like it's super hard to do anything. But if you get your one little thing in, you can still win. Is that more common in older fighting games? Yeah, so to me, this this is so similar to Zangief against uh, Dalsim in Super Turbo, where Dalsim just keeps him out so hard, and it's so difficult for, for Zangief to do anything. And he has to thread the needle to to win any match. Like, What's that, uh, you're just expected to lose, and this is so similar here. It's yeah. Like, Ice numbers are just expected to lose here. What's that matchup considered to be? Like 9-1. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. That's crazy. But in that game, there's a lot of these uh, 8 2 and 9 1 matchups. <laughs> Not as balanced as the newer games. Yeah. Okay, newer so. games tends to tend to have patches as well. So, anyway, uh, Armada with a huge lead already. Not looking good for Chu. Armada just, you know. I think FD played a huge part in that first game. I don't think necessarily that Armada changed anything in his playstyle. Oh, that was very rough. That four there, that they oh, smacked the turn Popo in. into oblivion. And oh, Armada with the brutal pressure, and he's gonna just kill Nana. No, Nana Armada, still survives. Yeah, pressing hella buttons right there. Oh, Nana. Yeah, she's gonna survive. He tries to keep her alive because it's so hard for the sofa. Wow, that was crazy. Yeah, that's that's the end of Nana. Now he only has one Nana left. Yeah. The Nana of his dreams. Possibly the last Nana of this set. Yeah. As he goes down. Probably out. the last Nana of the set. Let's see what he can do. Let's not hope to see a four stock here. Oh, uh, up smash and tier. Crowd cheering. Cheering for Chu. Wanting you to do good, but this uh, might be the end of Nana, and that's nah, it. That short stay, bye bye. Uh, yeah. <laughs> this is that is the end yeah. of Chudat. Honestly, in the winners yeah. Bracket. I think I think it's safe to say this is the end of his winners. <laughs> and so poor yeah. chance. It's not happening, guys. <laughs> I hate to be a downer, but yeah, yeah. that was a weak so poor chance. This is literally a 10-0 matchup at this point. Definitely 10-0. <laughs> Sopo is considered to be extremely low tier. Yeah, and that's it. Oh, yeah, one, one more. more. One yeah, more. one more is needed. Oh, the <laughs> yep, that's it. All right. Well, well done by Chu, though. Upset everyone. You know, that was a big surprise taking a game there. Yeah. <laughs> Armada life laughing. Yeah, Chu is a competitor, so I mean, he's probably not too happy about being in losers, but at the same time, mm -hmm. he. He should be happy about being the first Ice Climbers to ever take a game of Armada. Yeah. Armada is laughing. He's probably talking about that <laughs> just now. He's like, 
that's the first time yeah. I've ever lost, etc. <laughs> it, it's, so. it's funny to me because a lot of times when people are talking about the best ice, ice climber in the world, we hear Wobbles, we hear Nintendo, uh, before we used to hear Fly. Um, not a lot of people mention Inchu, and he, I mean, he gets results on.